Hello, I'm Artifacts of Mars, and uh, we have a group called Black Panthers, everybody knows their name. What they want to do is they want to migrate to five southern states. They want blacks to migrate to five southern states, take them over, and form an own, their own nation within the nation. Of course, the idea is they would drive on all the whites. Because this is a very nasty, nasty organization, Black Panthers. Blacks need to migrate. New Black Panther leader, Blacks need to migrate to the South for their own country. The New Black Panther Party held a rally in Baton Rouge this weekend after the shooting and death of Alton Sterling last week by two police officers. New Black Panther leaders... I'm not going to try and pronounce it, I'm just going to call them B.O. It makes no sense, the spelling. B.O. urged blacks to migrate south so they can form their own country against away from whitey, racist whitey. And here we thought segregation was racist. B.O., the so-called National Minister of Defense for the People's New Black Panther Party, says this group and white organizations have their sights set on establishing their own government in a nation within a nation. Now, you look at people's... Anytime you have that people's thing in the name of a nation... That's cold word for communism. B.O. was speaking in an interview set to air Sunday night in this, this reporter's talk radio program, Aaron Klein, investigative radio broadcast on New York's AM 970, the Answer News Talk, 990 AM, Philadelphia. B.O., Use the interview to claim five states as belonging to the Black Panther, the Black Nation. Louisiana, Mississippi, South Carolina, Alabama, and Georgia. So, what they're saying is, you whites, you're just supposed to move out of those states. Because you're not welcome there, and we're going to drive you out. That's basically what this miscreant is saying. The revolutionaries stated, we just need to start migrating back to those states and take control of the economics in those states. If black people move in, most definitely white people move out. So it's not a hard process for us to have our own country within the country. Well, like, yeah, it is. Uh, if you try to base your country solely on... Uh, your skin color, you're going to be seriously disappointed with the results. B.O. is also a co-founder of the Huey P. Newton Gun Club, a black militant gun group named after Black Panther Party founder Huey P. Newton. According to reports, Dallas shooter Micah X. Johnson, which is B.S., liked the Huey P. Newton Gun Club and B.O. has said that he wanted to recognize Johnson from black community events in Dallas. That he recognized Johnson. Asked by this reporter what his group's in game is, B.O. replied, The end game is land ownership. The end game is our own government in the nation within the nation. Okay, so we claim the states of Louisiana, we claim the states of Mississippi, we claim the state of South Carolina, Alabama, and Georgia. We just need to start migrating to those states and take control of the economics in those states. 
white people moved in, and definitely, most definitely white people will move out. So it's not a hard process for us to have our own country within the country. So, here's a picture of this miscreant. Notice the uh, necklace around his neck. That is the Egyptian Ankh. So it's actually some pagan religion he adheres to. So you white folks, you've seen the five states. You might as well just start moving on because you're going to be forced out by this uh, communist and his band of thugs. This isn't going to happen, but you got to watch out for these scum because they are dangerous. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. I would, I would definitely keep an eye on this bunch because they're trouble one way or the other. Especially now we have George Soros and Obama are instigating all this trouble because Obama wants to stay in power. And what I'm thinking is that Obama will instigate so much trouble that the people will be begging for order, and that's when he brings in the Strong Cities Network full force and take control of things with Obama as an administrator, of course. This is Obama and Soros taking over, basically. George Soros, the evil, evil socialist. George Soros is a wicked, wicked man. So, there you have it. Uh, let me ask you, Black Panthers, something. Why don't you move to, why don't you try moving to Liberia? I mean, after all, Liberia was uh, for, formed because of the slavery in the United States. Freed slaves went there, and they formed their own country. Why don't you move there? It's because you all have it better here than I mean, blacks in Africa. Most of those countries are dictatorships with vicious, vicious governments and tribal warfare and everything else. That's why you don't move there. Why don't you start acting like Americans? All you different miscreant groups, I don't just mean blacks. Start acting like Americans and standing up for freedom in the flag instead of doing all this crap. Unbelievable. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.